high priced high priced uh, burger joints that are popping up um, you not know, like your regular McDonald's or your your Burger King or your Wendy's or um, or uh, Whataburger uh, but places that charge a little bit like twice as much for a burger um, over there, over at these places so anyway we're over at this one place this this is the burger place and they had um, they just kind of opened up they just uh, they they're kind of a new new place and so we went to check it out um, I don't know it wasn't it wasn't a whole lot I mean it, they had more of a choice over at this burger place than they did over at um, over at in and out burger uh, I, I think um, but you can see there they get uh, vertical bars and they got horizontal bars and if you saw they had a clean out there the clean out is that silver uh, circular thing right there on the left uh, they had a clean out on the other side of the on the wall actually so that was interesting I, I've never seen a clean out that high above and actually away from the toilet so that was kind of interesting uh, another cool thing is that the, the uh, sink here is high enough so uh, so my knees will not uh, well my knees will not make contact with the sink and they will not um, uh, rub up against the sink so I can get real real close to the sink so that was pretty awesome um, one of the one of the things that I felt like doing was it was just easier for me to and if there is enough space then it's easier for me to use the urinal uh, to catheterize and that's what I do um, you can see here that uh, uh, I use the catheter I unravel the catheter that I have tied to my wheelchair frame underneath my seat see, underneath the seat of my wheelchair uh, there's another friend on YouTube that I have that um, he what he does is he puts the catheter um, he has like a little fanny pack almost type of thing uh, or a belly pack or, or I don't know whatever you call it where you're at um, and uh, he just hang that's hanging to the front of his wheelchair and he puts the catheter in there and the lubricant and the um, actually an extension tube also for catheterizing so he puts all those sorts of different things in there uh, I have my vacuum system hooked up uh, everything in this restroom I uh, this is pretty. It's a pretty new, uh, pretty new construction restroom. So everything was um, uh, motion sensor. It, the, the toilet flushed on its own. It motion sense, motion sensor, and flushed on its own. It's not. I didn't flush the toilet. I didn't not want to flush the toilet because I wanted to be mean or anything like that. Um, you can see that the sink is motion sensor all, also. Um, so that's pretty much the way it's going. Every everything is going to be motion sensor, but the only thing that's not motion sensor, uh, as you can see, is the um, is the soap dispenser, and and it was that foam stuff. So you know, I I don't care about that foam too much. I don't I don't really like it uh, too much. It just doesn't seem to get the hands as cl as clean as possible. But Anyway, uh, so I washed off my catheter in there to the clean cath uh, method, uh, clean cath wash washing method, and just wash it with my hands and blow it out with, uh, you know, with my mouth. Um, a lot of people can't do that because they have uh, they get UTIs or urinary tract infections very easily. So, you know, you, it, it all just depends on the ouch. How what you do to clean up uh, your catheter uh, after you get done with it? Uh, you can. You also saw that the um, uh, paper towels dispenser was motion censored, and uh, it was pretty good too because usually the paper towels that are dispensed are very very tiny. They're they aren't very long, and, and uh, this one was cool because I only needed a couple times. Uh, of the paper towels to be dispensed so I would have enough 
um, it's good to use the, the paper towels afterwards to, uh, to use that to open up the door and to uh, open up the lock and things like that because you know that way you don't have to worry so much about bacteria uh, from people because a lot of people don't wash their hands after they get done with using the restroom and that's not a very good thing. I priced